Hey, hi. I'm Crescent Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do right at home. I'm just studying this luminescent tube and going over today's science file. And today's science file says... Can you light a bulb without plugging it in? Well, that's a wicked question. Try this. Oh! You will need an energy saving bulb and a balloon. Okay, first up, you want to get yourself one of these fluorescent light bulbs. You know what? It doesn't matter, because I got one right here. And here. <laughs> and here too. Ha ha! Ha ha! You are gonna get yourself a balloon! And you're gonna blow it up. Oh yeah! 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 Was that you testing your colon? I'm kidding, it was just a balloon. <laughs> Find yourself a dark room. No, no, it doesn't have to be that dark. Just, you know, just turn the lights back on. Now, take the balloon, and you're gonna give yourself a new hairdo, like this! Okay, quick! Move the balloon back and forth really fast near the light bulb, and you'll get it to glow like this! Glow like this! <laughs> now that is so cool! The balloon made the light bulb glow. So why does the balloon make the light bulb glow when they come next to each other? Well, get yourself charged up and take a closer look at this. When you move the negatively charged balloon back and forth near the light bulb, you create a current of ions. Positive ions moving in the direction of the charged balloon and negative ions moving away. As the ions move either toward or away from the balloon, they smack into mercury atoms and knock off some of the mercury atoms' electrons, which charges the ions inside the tube. Unless the mercury atoms collide with another atom, the energy is given off is ultraviolet light that we can't see. The reason we're able to see the light is because inside the glass tube are several phosphors. These phosphors absorb the ultraviolet light and give off light we can see. This is pretty much exactly how energy saving bulbs and fluorescent tubes work when plugged into an electric socket. The only difference is that fluorescent tubes don't have very many ions in them, which is why sometimes they flicker before turning on. So now you know how these fluorescent light bulbs work! You know, lighting a fluorescent light bulb using a balloon? Glow like this! Glow like this! Is why science? It's so cool.